Good afternoon everyone and welcome to a new video on the channel. It is Wednesday the 23rd of February 2022 and tonight I'm heading to Spenny Moor Town versus Ryup Corrier Welfare in the quarter-final of the Durham Challenge Cup. So I'm currently in Billingham, uh, I'm going to get picked up from here in a bit, then uh, head to Spenny Moor from there. Um, going into this game, Spenny Moor are currently 13th in the National League North table. Uh, they bounced back from their loss at the International Stadium weekend last night with a 2-0 win at Chester. Um, while Ryan are currently 5th in Northern League Division 1, they'll obviously be a completely different Spenny Moor team to what we saw at the International Stadium at the weekend, because uh, obviously... They've played in the league last night, they've got another league game on Saturday and they've still got a bit of a chance of getting in the playoffs, although it is pretty thin. Uh, as for Ryup, um, it's got to be honest now, their chances of, of promotion are getting away from them, uh, but still, obviously they're going into the, uh, the First Division Cup from... Either next week or the week after, I'm not too sure. Um, as well, I've also got this, so there's still plenty for them to shoot for this season. And obviously, you'd imagine the changes Spenny will make that'll that'll sort of even it out. So, should be a pretty good contest this night. I'm looking forward to it as it goes. Uh, anyway, I'll do the rest of the travel footage to Spenny Muir, then I will see you inside the brewery field. So the Spenny team are out to warm up and as expected they're basically a completely different team to what sort of the weekend uh, Raya are yet to come out. So Raya are out warming up at the far end, it looks like they're going to be in a change trip tonight. Uh, the winners of this tie will go on to face West Auckland at home in the semi-final. Right here come the teams. Oh, 
half time spending with a town nil right quality welfare too and to be fair Riot thoroughly deserved it so far they've been excellent um, started the game off with creating quite a few chances but maybe nothing too major uh, Spenny should have gone one to look with that with that header there the keeper was all over the place but it ended up going wide and from there had a bit of a spell but again nothing too much then uh, obviously Riot perhaps deservedly went went ahead then uh, doubled it right on half time uh, I think like like you can see the younger players are spending are really struggling out there. Um, if, if they get the next goal, it might spark them into life. Uh, it'll be an interesting second half. Full-time spending me with Town 1, right, call your welfare for, and I've got to say that was one of the best performances I've seen from any bond so far this season, I thought, right, for excellent there, um, obviously, as I said at half-time, they were definitely the better team in the first half, uh, in terms of the second half, uh, Spenny uh, came out of the traps uh, quite quickly, uh, got the goal back, as great goal it was, then from there they had a bit of a spell where they were put right up under quite a bit of pressure but but to no avail I mean that uh that Afusu was getting about a fair bit I mean he hit the crossbar one was another uh just before that where he was bearing down on goal but he hit it over I mean if it had squared it to the player on his right then I think Spenny might have scored from that it could have been a different game here but um I'd say the uh, right up sort of sort of uh, calm the game down at, at the right time really then uh, once they'd once they'd done that they went went on and got got the third goal um sort of clean through where uh, there's never gonna miss them then fourth goal was was an excellent strike I think on a half volley into the bottom corner so um yeah really Im impressive there for him right up tonight uh, and to be honest with you I didn't think they were that bad the other week against RCA, it was just they just couldn't take take the chances. Whereas tonight they well and truly did, and they will go on to face West Auckland in the semi final. That that was the makings of a pretty decent cup tie. That to be fair. Um, so yeah, uh, but anyway, that is that for this video. I'll be back on Saturday with AFC Telford United versus Gateshead. So big game at both ends of the table. Looking forward to it. Until then, take care and I will see you later.